Find me. Hi. My name is Mary B. Happy, happy, oh, good boy. Happy Good Friday. And um, today is a business one. I'm open at two. It's not here. And I'm going to show you. What is it? Ice cream. Mm -hmm. It's a clock. And I'm going to have ice cream in it. Uh -huh. Well, what's Good Friday about? Let's talk about that. What's um, Good Friday? Good Friday is about when Jesus yeah, it's the day we remember when he died, right? So, and now we opened up the egg and it was a white cloth. So let's read what the white cloth's about. And I just gonna read it for us. What is it? After Jesus died, a man named Joseph asked if he could bury him. This was a brave and loving thing for Joseph to do. Remember that the, the man, the men, who killed Jesus did not believe that he was the Son of God, but Joseph did believe, and he wanted to Jesus have his proper burial. Joseph knew that this might get him in trouble with the soldiers, but but he was brave, and he asked for permission anyway. Joseph wrapped the body of Jesus in a cloth and buried him in a tomb, cut out of a rock like a shallow cave. Joseph went away sad because Joseph was Joseph was dead, and he wondered what would happen next. Yeah, so after Jesus died, they took him off the cross. He was dead. And Joseph, a guy who, you know, risked a lot by said and said, Hey, can I bury him in my tomb? And so he took a cloth, and he wrapped him up and gave Jesus a proper burial, right? Because really, they were just going to leave him. And but now they buried him in a nice, you know, he, he took him and that took a lot of guts on Joseph's part. So now he wraps him in a cloth and he buries him in that tomb, which is really like a cave with a rock. And then they put a, yeah. Oh, Nathan. Say bye. Bye. Say bye. happy good Friday. Happy good Friday. Happy good Friday. What are those? Mary, this is Isaac. This is Nathan Isaac. And, um, and, and these are called Reggie and I'm, and I'm gonna. What's the egg today? It is chicken. And I'm gonna, and I'm not opening it. What's the rock? What is it? It's a stone. Let me it's see. Oh, what? Nathan, let me see it. What's a what's a stone? It's a stone. So what's a stone got to do? Tomorrow's Easter. So where did we leave off? We left off with Jesus died on the cross. Remember, Joseph took his body, wrapped it up in a white cloth, and put it in a tomb. Let's read what this was yesterday's. Yes. Okay. So read it, Isaac. Yeah, but you got to listen to the story. Ready? Ready, guys? Ready? Okay. One, two, three. The stone. That was one in front of Jesus' too was much bigger than the stone in the end. It was as big as a door, probably. Weighed and, and, and weighed more than a car. After Jesus was buried, special soldiers were assigned to stand to stand and guard at the tomb. But these men were no match for God's angel. It took just one angel to ward the stone away. The guards were so afraid they fainted. Where did the angel get his strength from, from God? Oh, so he got his strength from God. So the angel, a giant earthquake happened and an angel moved the giant stone that weighed about the, weighed about the size of a car. Yeah, that's the picture. Mom, yeah. Dude, so so what's tomorrow, oh, guys? What's tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. It is Say Easter, so he's gonna be he's risen. He is risen indeed. Woohoo! We'll find out what the last I'm egg is. Bye bye! Say bye. See ya. bye. I'm cleaning this box, Mom. To give you a hint, it might be an angel. Bye.
Nathan, it's Easter morning. Uh, Yay! There you go. Good job. So what's the egg? What's the last egg? We're so wait, excited. Wait. Oh, I didn't know. We opened it. It opens by itself. Oh, what is it? it? Why is there nothing? It's empty. Nathan, why is it empty? Because it's the tomb. That's the tomb? Yeah, he's not alive again. And he's alive again. He's not dead anymore. So it's empty egg because Jesus is alive. The yeah. tomb was empty. All right, Isaac, go ahead and read. Um, okay. When two more women came to the tomb of Jesus, they were surprised too. The heavy stone was rolling into the, out, outside, outside the tomb. It was empty. Jesus' body was not there. The angel told them he is willing. He came back to life. This was the promise that Jesus has made to his disciples at the special dinner just a few days before that he would be that he would die. But come, but he came back to life to show those who believed in him that 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 they would live forward to somebody because some someday because he died for us we can meet him and thank him in heaven that's the story of easter and it's true and it's true the first easter morning was an empty tomb the women went and there was there was no nothing there, no body there. So happy Easter, everyone. Say happy Easter. Happy Easter. Say see you next year. See Nathan, next... say bye. Yeah. Oh, Corona. All right. <laughs> happy Easter. Happy